good quality, nice piece of stainless steel here. Before you fit it, just go around and make sure you take all the burrs off because there's some very sharp burrs which would have cut you. You can see it's just spaced off from the system that far and just with, the, with a little lock nut and a nut on the outside just for place it to there. Um, that just protects the unit. Out here on the end, we've got a multi-pin plug, which is a DIN pl the plug. This is a torch high control system, which has got some manual. We don't know how to work this yet. We will work on that. Now, that got some Allen keys that come with it. That just bolts on here. Okay, we have the machine on. We have the motors engaged. So it now doesn't move. If the motors disengage, the whole thing will slide quite easily along the, along the tracks. Okay, first thing we do is we get a we have to get a part cut. So this is um, the library. Go into the library, and then use the, the arrow keys to go to the one we want to look at. We'll have the le rectangle one there. Enter, standard enter. It brings it up in the sizes, so we'll say, okay, we want to cut it uh, 200 by function down 200 by 50. We'll leave those as the same. Top entry, then it's got an entry and a drop. All those are things we'll, we'll learn about. We want to apply. Okay, that's what she's turned out with.